today we're talking about how to stabilize video in DaVinci Resolve. Again, this is Cave Photography. First, we have to open DaVinci Resolve and uh, this is the before and after uh, stabilize the video so today i'm going to show you how to do it let's open the application davinci resolve so now let's create a new project this one double click the untitled project and uh, let's save is save us stabilize Okay, after you save this uh, project, let's proceed to uh, media and check some available footage that we can use for uh, this tutorial. For example, uh, I'm checking my previous video uh, somewhere in Dubai Mall. So this one, I think uh, I'm checking this the sample video, uh, this one. This video that I am going to use to stabilize this uh, footage, for example, okay, I am going to uh, drag this one into media photo import. No need to change the frame rates. And let's proceed to the edit tab and name it stabilize. Okay, click save and then drag it to the timeline. and then change the viewing option and then let's change the resolution as you can see my footage is 1080p and let's change to 1080p and then click save now after you change this one now i can copy so you can see the before and after uh, after we uh, stabilize the footage let's proceed to the color tab and then click the, the second footage change the window to stabilize and uh, yeah make sure that the playhead is in the very first frame and then click stabilize and wait until it's finished now the vinger soap is analyzing the footage to stabilize so let's wait until it's finished okay guys now it's done you can see the the wavelengths here in the footage and let's proceed to the edit tab so you can see the difference between the the, the previous one and then uh, the after st stabilizing the footage so that that's it guys so we can compare the the shape the we can compare the stability of the first footage to to the second footage So that's it guys thank you for watching i hope you learned something in this video and if you have any question about this tutorial you can comment down below and yeah thank you for watching and see you in the next one bye